There's a lot of things that we take for granted in agriculture. For example, if you buy seed and you're ready to plant your field, you just assume that the germination is going to be great. In fact, you look at the seed tag and the seed tag almost always either says 90% or 95% germ. So you think, well, wait a second, how is every seed out there 90% or 95% germ? Shouldn't there be some that's 99% or 93% or something like that? So yep. we wanna talk about these seed germination tests today. Yeah, so first of all, seed companies are going to tag it as low as they can, yet it still looks good for you. So for example, with seed corn, it's commonly tagged at 95%, but a lot of the stuff might be 98 or 99%. Well, they're not gonna tag it at 98 or 99, because then if an inspector walks in and finds it was tagged at 99, but it's only 97, they're gonna throw a fit. So the seed company's like, look, we're just gonna play it safe. We're just gonna call it 95% on the tag, even though it's actually better than that. 